The entire human race is deeply flawed for different reasons and I just need to address this because otherwise I think I might literally explode. I love the internet. And you know, I like people, but sometimes, sometimes they just, I'm just so frustrated right now. We need to stop doing this thing. This one applies to both sexes, where we're pretending to be things that we're not. Ladies, this one's for you. Stop dumbing yourself down for a man. Stop it. You need to cut that out right now. I'm angry, I'm yelling, I'm sorry. But really, you need to stop. Ugh. You have no idea, Hayden, how many times I see my friends, my friends even, beautiful women, beautiful, intelligent, eloquent, ambitious women, who as soon as a guy walks in, and it doesn't even have to be a guy that they're interested in, they could have a boyfriend, anything, just a guy walks into the group and all of a sudden, oh my god, I didn't know that. Really? Oh, you're so smart. <laughs> no, stop that. You don't do that when I walk in the room. You need to cut the Bambi wounded baby girl thing out. It's not cute when Paris Hilton did it. It's not cute when you do it. Stop. Not only are you being disingenuous with who you are and are you like sending this message of yourself that all you care about is I don't even know what, but you're inherently being sexist against your own sex, thinking that you have to downplay your intellect to be appreciated by a man. Perpetuating this entire notion, you're literally sending back the women's movement hundreds of years. Men, this one's for you. Two men, completely fine getting along. Girl walks in, could be a platonic friend, could be anything, not even interested in this girl. Automatically, these two start fighting becomes a whose penis is bigger fight. I, I mean, subconsciously, it's not like, you know, they whip them out. Oh my God, this is so inappropriate, I'm sorry. It starts into, oh, ha, 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 look at me, I'm such a man. No, look at me, I'm such a man. What? No, I'm such a man. Not attractive. Possessiveness, insecurity, jealousy, fighting. Guys, we've all evolved beyond this point. We are spent thousands of years in evolution from primates or from Adam and Eve, whatever you believe. The point is, we're not the same as we were when the existence of humans started. So stop acting like it. So be yourself, be yourself. Do not shy away from being intelligent because you think that it's gonna make you look pretentious or aloof. Who cares what other people think? Just be you, be you. Because otherwise, who are you being? Then I don't know who you are and it's just entirely frustrating. It's so frustrating and I'm just, I don't understand. I don't understand. I feel like it comes from this like deep rooted human insecurity where we feel that if we're who we truly are and people don't like us, then you know, it'll be the end of the world. So we pretend to be someone else and if they don't like us, we can like tell ourselves that it's fine because that's not who we really are. So how about this? I don't know, I thought. We be who we really are and if people don't like us, we get over it. How's that? Stop acting like a lesser version of yourself. You're doing yourself a deep injustice and you're doing other people an injustice by not giving them the opportunity of getting to know who you actually are. Ah! This has been a rant brought to you by Carolina Celaya, who is deeply animated and uses her hands a lot to talk. No, but really, it's just because I love you. Like, guys, just be yourself. I love you so much as you are. And if I don't love you, that's fine. My opinion is not the end-all be-all.